Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new. Today's video is going to be a haul and I have not done a haul for you guys in what feels like forever. So I'm really excited. All of these pieces you guys have been asking me about a lot on Instagram. I have been kind of waiting to do this collective haul for you guys once I got like enough stuff, I guess. I don't know. I just kept shopping and waiting for stuff to come in. And I was like, okay, I'm gonna do the haul when this package comes in. And then I would online shop again. So then I'm like, okay, I'll do the haul when this package comes in. So um, it was kind of a never ending cycle of continuous shopping. So I figured, let me just, do a little roundup of the things I've collected over I would say the past month or two um, and these are just some of the pieces that I've been wearing at the beginning of this lovely hot girl summer it's currently I think it's still spring but honestly once it starts getting like a little bit warmer out that is when I feel like summer starts anyways I figured I would do this by store because um, I just feel like that will be easier um, I also have my protein coffee here guys this by the way this mason jar thing with a lid and a straw is the best thing i think i've ever owned like just generally speaking the best thing i've ever owned amazing amazing amazon i will link it down below i think it was like 20 dollars, which is low-key kind of expensive for a mason jar but honestly it's worth it okay first things first let's start off with are you am i I am obsessed with RUMI. Um, they actually invited me into their showroom, which was really dope. Um, and they gifted me a few things. So these things, of all the stuff that I have, some of it's gifted, a lot of it I actually purchased myself. This was gifted, but um, like I said, some of it's like Amazon or like wherever. So I honestly bought it myself. Um, the first thing is this top that I'm obsessed with. You can wear it a bunch of different ways and kind of like tie it yourself. You can make it like a bandeau. You can just overall make it like a scarf top without tying it in the middle. This is how I put it on today. Um, I thought it was a bikini top at first, but it's definitely not. It's definitely a shirt because the material is that kind of like linen-y like thick fabric. Um, I'm obsessed with it. I love it so much. It's like my new favorite shirt. Then I also got this skirt from them. It's so cute. It's a little like micro mini. It's absolutely so short. My butt shows in it. So I need to figure out a way that I can wear it. Like if you have a booty, it's a little bit difficult because you don't want to size up because then it's going to be like an awkward size. Like it's not going to fit right. Um, but the one that fits me around the hips is really, really short. I'm also like 5'11", so it's tough, but it's super cute. So I'll insert photos of me wearing this skirt, um, and you can obviously see me wearing the top. If there's anything that I haven't worn in a photo, I will try it on for you guys, but almost everything I've already worn, so you guys can see kind of how I style it, which I feel like is almost better. Um, but if you guys want me to do like a traditional try-on haul like I used to do, I'm more than happy to do that. Leave me a request of what store I should do like a full try-on haul from. Okay, then my jewelry. You guys have been asking about my jewelry as well. Um, I got some new stuff. Um, this is from CNC Luxury. This is from HRH. This is from Etsy. It's like a little, I don't know if this is in focus. It's a little smiley face like pearl bracelet thing. This is from And Other Stories. These like chunky rings are from um, Amazon. This is from Ana Luisa. This is from Etsy. This little like rainbow bracelet. This one is from this. It's really cute. It has like different color, um, uh, what's it called? Crystals and stuff. It is from, or like little fake diamonds. Um, it's from actually the flea market. Uh, this one's from HRH. And then my hoops are also CNC. So love that. Um, and I also have a really cute body chain. It is, where the hell is it? I'm obsessed with it, you guys. I've been wearing it so often. It's so cute. Um, and this is from Heart of Sun. And it's like one of the only body chains I have. And it doesn't tarnish. And it's really comfortable. And it's great quality. Um, so yeah. Next, let's just continue on the accessory train. I will show you the new handbags that I've gotten recently. And some sunglasses. As far as bags go, it's a, it's a mixed bag, no pun intended. Um, I can go from 0 to 100. I like either higher end bags or literally bags that I found at Zara on the sale rack for $7. So these two, this one is really cute and this little, oops, I'm like dropping stuff here. Um, this little kind of like sack purse, you can't really see it. Let me try to show you guys. Um, I swear it's cute. It's a little like satiny bucket bag type of thing with like this metallic silver chain. And then I also got this one, which is kind of like a monochromatic little greenish gray one. And it has like this cute little chain. And I feel like these are good if you want to go out at night and you don't want to get your nicer bags like ruined or dirty or stolen or I don't know. 
um, you never know with like stuff starting to open up and stuff um, stuff and stuff here in LA I just feel like I'd like to have some like less expensive bags just in case because I'm also a hot mess and I will like leave my stuff places and like I don't know get it dirty um, then I also got this really cute bag this is just like a little yellow kind of clutch type of thing you can put the the long strap in or you can have it out um it's not really coming across on camera but it's a really pretty like light pale yellow color and i have been loving this one i feel like it's a good mixture of like kind of dressed up and you can also wear it casually because it has the long strap this is from teddy blake i think it's really really cute it's actually great quality um and it surprisingly holds a ton of stuff beware though i stuffed this a lot and i do think i something fell out um but it holds a lot of stuff just don't overstuff it then i got two bags from prada i actually have a girlfriend who works at prada and she hooked me up with like helping me out picking up bags and stuff um so i got this one which is just a really simple like classic kind of flat bag it reminds me a lot of the boy chanel because it has this like chunky chain i really wanted something a little bit edgier with the chain because um some of my other bags are very like just classic and girly which i like and this is still girly don't get me wrong but i like that i can wear this with edgier outfits and it goes because of this like brushed silver chain um and then on the complete opposite end of that i got a really girly bag this is a really cute summer bag in my opinion this is a another prada bag and it's white or like off-white i guess with gold hardware um and a little gold strap that you can have long or short i personally i don't know why i really like these bags shorter like this i think it looks more flattering um but i really love this this fits a ton of stuff and it has been my go-to like nicer um daytime bag and because i feel like it's it's crossbody and it's small like in the sense that like it, it's not obnoxious to bring around but it actually fits a ton of stuff that i need that you know i need the option to bring a ton of stuff i don't really bring more than like my wallet my lip gloss and like I don't know that's it sunglasses i guess gum but i need the option to be able to like stuff random stuff in there like a granola bar if i get hungry i want a little ham with the shein sunglasses i don't know why these ones are actually not shein i'll show you the first pair that are from um ray eyewear these are really cute these are just like brown tortoiseshell type of vibe i really like them they're a really good everyday pair not really a statement one um and then i bought four pairs of like ridiculous ones um not ridiculous but like just a little bit more out there i got these green ones they're all kind of in the same style but these black and yellow ones i actually got off amazon not shein um but the green ones these orange ones and then i also got a pair of these like off white cream colored ones that you guys have probably seen me wear a lot i'll insert a photo i actually don't know where they are right now i think they're in my purse my other purse um those ones i got all from shein and they're really just fun and like i'm not gonna wear them forever you know what i mean like i feel like stuff like this like i know it's not great to support fast fashion brands when it comes to trendy things i hope you guys can understand like little um rink -dink things like this where like I, i'm probably not gonna wear it for more than a couple months financially it does not make sense for me to buy the expensive version like it just it just doesn't okay i got some cute revolve pieces um first thing is this sweater cardigan top situation oh the sleeves are actually inside out um i wore this to a cute brunch with a pair of like loose fitting pants that i'll show you guys later um in the same kind of cream color and it was kind of a look i feel like you could wear this as like a toss over beach cardigan you probably can't see it all insert photo um you could wear this as like a loose fitting beach cardigan or you could wear it as a shirt with just like a few of the buttons buttoned and like a cute bralette underneath which is what i did and i really liked that then i also got this top which is one of those like little scarf tops it's pretty similar to what i'm wearing right now except this one you can't like untie it or whatever it's just already like this um i wore this in san diego when i went with a pair of white jeans and my little like gucci um mules and i thought it was a really cute fit and this one feels like really comfortable um and it's like a nice like flattering i don't know s style i guess um then i got this cute this one i actually got ages ago but i've just rediscovered it you can't forget this lighting is washing everything out you really can't see this can you see it back here better it's a bunch of cute like more bright pastel colors um and it's just a little tube top 
and I feel like this with a cute pair of boyfriend jeans just is a, a, a adorable outfit. Um, and then I got one of these dresses that I feel like are very popular right now, um, the like collared polo button down long sleeve dresses. This one is gray, obviously. And I just wore that with some Jordans and I wore it to like a little happy hour situation and it was super cute. Next is Tiger Mist and I got a couple of things from them and I honestly love Tiger Mist. I feel like out of a lot of the fast fashion brands, they kind of kill it in terms of being on top of the trends. Um, I know they're a sister store to IMG is, so like that kind of says a lot. Um, but anyways, I got this little like baby pink striped wrap top. This reminded me of like a cute little like Nantucket, Cape Cod, like beachy uh, vibe. And so I wore this to brunch with those white, like off-white sunglasses that I was telling you guys about. Not off-white the brand, off-white like cream. Um, and it was super cute. And then this one I actually wore last night to dinner um, and I really liked it. I just wore it with simple jeans and a pair of little white like kitten heel type of things. And again, I'll insert photos of all these outfits because I've worn all of them already. Um, but this was just a cute little like 90s vibe. I really like it. So comfy. I found it really, really flattering too. Um, so yeah, love this. And their quality honestly is great. Like you wouldn't even know that it's Tiger Mist. Not that there's anything wrong with Tiger Mist, but it, it doesn't look like inexpensive. Um, and then these pants I wore to dinner the other night. And I wore these, what the heck did I wear them with? I wore them with like one of those little black wrap tops. Not the one I just showed, but a different one, like a more scandalous one. Um, and they were so comfortable and they're like the perfect length, the perfect style. I really like them. They look pretty expensive. The only thing is they're getting better. Like now that I've worn them out once, they're not so bad. But to be honest, they smelled, now I'm thinking about it. I wonder if people thought I smelled like fish. You know how like fake leather pants smell like fish? Like these smell like fish. So it's kind of like, there's a fishy smell coming from my lower half. Like it's not the most ideal situation, you know what I'm saying? But um, the pants were cute, so whatever. Okay, next I truly don't know what this boutique is called. I like really genuinely don't know. So I'm gonna have to find it online for you guys um, or in my like whatever, like shopping cart history. I don't know, like the email confirmation. I don't know what I'm saying. I'll find it for you guys, okay? And I'll link it down below. Off the top of my head though, I have no idea. I bought these from an Instagram ad, okay? But this shirt is cute AF and I saw a photo of like a ton of girls. I think Madison Beer was wearing this. A, a bunch of other people have been wearing these cute little, like it was like a, this specific pink and green little lace cami type of thing. And I was like, that's so freaking cute. I need it. So yeah, I wore this on a night out as well with a pair of just cute like ripped Zara jeans um, and a little pair of heels and it was just freaking adorable. It's like very Miami vibes in my opinion. And I got this top. I don't know. I, I don't know you guys, okay? I just feel like there's gonna be a night. There's gonna be a night this summer. Summer 2021. The summer after this whole panorama, you know? I just feel like there's gonna be a night where this comes in handy. My boyfriend was laughing. He's like, what is the freaking Mardi Gras? Like, what did you get this for? I'm like, you know what? You hate now, but when you see this thing in action, you're not gonna be hating. Cause this is low key fire. I brought it to a photo shoot and the photographer was like, that's amazing. So we actually shot in it and I will again, insert photos. Um, I just feel like there's gonna be a time where this comes in handy. You know, I saw it and I was like, it's like $35 or something like that. Like it's kind of stupid, like it's a dumb purchase. But I think I should do it. Like something was just telling me I should and I, I don't think I'm gonna regret it. I don't. Um, then I got this little orange top. Again, I wore this to my friend's birthday party um, already. I've been making really great use out of all of these shirts. And that's why I love stuff like this because you can wear a different cheap ass little half shirt. I love to mix and match. I love to wear like a new fun top. Um, and like put little silly outfits together. So I don't know, hot girl summer, you guys, I don't know. I wear the same freaking outfit, like a baggy pair of pants or like a wrap skirt with a shirt that ties like that. Um, and then these have been a very hot topic of discussion recently on my Instagram and my TikTok. Um, these two dresses, the black and the green, I know they're a Bomba Swim knockoff, okay, okay, because I wanted the Bomba Swim ones and then they kept going out of stock and then by the time I was, I kind of like forgot about it 
And then by the time people started wearing them again, I was like, TBH, we're at the tail end of that trend. Like, I feel like these dresses were hot, like, even last summer when I really wanted it. Like, I remember for my birthday, I was going to buy this dress in October of 2020. So, um, realistically, I feel like it just, I couldn't justify it. I couldn't justify the price tag. I really couldn't, guys. So, sue me, you know? I'm sorry. Like, and they look bomb. And the quality is not bad. And they're a trendy piece. Like, I'm not going to wear these forever. So, you know what? Balling on a budget, okay? That's all I got to say. Then I got some more, like, Shein pieces. I know I got more than just this, but this is all I really remember to take out this shirt i wore in kind of like a color blocking look um i wore it to this cute little restaurant um here in la this little vegan spot called fresh and you guys were all asking me about this shirt and it's from shein so don't freaking come for me because y'all were all obsessed with this top and i wore it with like a little um green skirt and or blue skirt and it was super cute um i also got this like oversized hippie looking sweater which i love as well it's actually quite soft and not itchy at all which is lovely um love that and um all these things i got in a this one i got in a medium um the tops i got in a small um this is super cute this is just a little skirt and i felt like this would just be fun i haven't actually worn this one yet but I feel like it'll be a fun look with like some little crop top or I don't know something um then I got these like flare jeans I felt like these would be fun they're a tight bell bottom these actually make you look snatched like I'm not even gonna lie they're very flattering um they're super comfortable these are a medium they're the perfect length I actually feel like I almost could have sized down in these um but they're the length would have probably been too short so I'm glad I didn't the only thing off-putting is this weird freaking spongebob looking decal on the pocket but it's on the butt pocket and i feel like at night no one's gonna freaking notice um but they were cute and they were cheap af and honestly they make your body look fantastic um then i got this pair of velvet pants these i also haven't worn yet they're kind of sus but they're also kind of awesome um i feel like these with like a really simple black top and a pair of like really high platform like boots or heels or something would be kind of a look um, so I got these and they're just a, again like kind of a flare bottom um, Velvet pant high waisted skin tight Really cute honestly flattering and they feel like pajamas. So I'm here for it next. I got some Zara vibes um, These are the pants. I was telling you guys about this like simple. I feel like this is a summer staple simple low-waisted kind of baggy um, cream colored almost sheer like banana yellow cream colored pants these are just a vibe like these with a pair of sandals on the beach these with a pair of heels to brunch they're just great and i got this little like periwinkle blue top it's cute i just wore it to something i think i wore it to a dinner um and it was adorable i got this little lacy crop top which is also super freaking cute this one's so comfy and adorable and perfect for summer with like denim shorts or like little skirt um i also picked up this little dress which i wore at a trailer themed bar in san diego um and it was very cute and it kind of fit the vibe i feel like this at nighttime i wore it with a pair of mules but during the day i would this was way more daytime i don't know why i wore it at night to be honest i think it was like all i packed with me um but it was super comfortable and i ate a lot that day and it felt fantastic um and it's also really cute for the daytime with a pair of like cowboy boots um i feel like it'd be perfect and i got these random pink shorts these on my story on instagram you guys kept being like i thought you weren't wearing pants like where are those shorts from they're from zara they are really cute um they're one of those like weird like they only have two sizes extra small small or medium large i got the extra small small and they actually fit perfect because i tried the medium large and they just were a little bit too long and lastly we have some amazon faves um this cute little number which i wore it to a photo shoot with a full cowgirl set up um and then i got two pairs of like boyfriend shorts um these little white ones they're just like basic and these champion black ones again just cute and lastly i got a freaking adorable hoodie i love this i think this is so cute it's from the mayfair group you guys know i love bears so i got this little you can read it yourself 
I hope you guys enjoyed this. I had so much fun filming this haul. I honestly forgot how much freaking fun it is to film. Um, I've been really excited. I've been planning, plotting on some YouTube videos for you guys. So I can't wait to get on those. Um, but in the meantime, I always say this and I hope you guys actually do it. Please leave me below like any of your video requests or if you don't feel comfortable sharing them here, you can DM me on Instagram with your video requests. Um, but I am going to be filming up a storm this summer. I'm so excited. Like, do you want going out with me vlogs? Do you want get ready with me? Do you want more recipes? Do you want more hauls? Um, like, let me know what you guys want to see and I will provide. Um, so anyways, that is all for today's video. I love you guys all so much and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.